I'm here at the PE Center to catch up with Frontier Conference Women's Indoor Field Athlete of the Week, Nikki Kruger. Kruger reached a new personal best of 14.44 in shot put at the Mountain State Games. She took first at the meet, which put her second in the NAIA. Kruger had to overcome a hamstring injury, which forced her to sit out the first meet of the year, which makes this honor all the more special. It's, it's an honor. Um, we've been working really hard this year. Uh, I missed a meet, um, so we weren't sure where I was going to be with that. Um, so I'm glad that I went out last weekend and threw what I threw and got the, the Frontier Player of the Week. So. Kruger and her teammates have been focusing on good energy for the season, which she says allowed her to perform so well at the Mountain State Games. We kind of are talking about like manifesting, like put it out into the universe and it'll happen. Um, so we've been just really focusing on um, the process. Uh, last year that was our big focus too, um, but this year it's kind of just a little different. It's my last year, so we were just like, you gotta go out and have fun and kind of let loose, so that's what I did. Kruger didn't even know that she had performed as well as she did. So actually we were thinking that I was throwing a little less than that um, until we actually looked after prelims um, going into finals. We looked online and I was like, oh, okay, that's what we're throwing because I couldn't see the reader board or anything. So we were like, oh, that's a good spot to be in. So. Coming in first at the Mountain State Games means Kruger beat NAIA, D2, and D1 throwers, which she says proves that the NAIA is competitive. It's a lot of fun beating the D1 throwers. Um, it just kind of takes a weight off your shoulder that you're you're doing well and um, to keep going in that NAIA is so competitive. Last year, Kruger was first in the NAIA and won the indoor shot put national title. This year, she's not necessarily chasing either. No, I'm not really chasing first. Last year, it was a it was a big goal, you know, head into nationals first, keep it, um, obviously win a national title. Um, but this year, I'm, I'm okay with sitting in second, maybe get a little nerves going in and then see what I can throw. But just going to go in and see what happens. Um, obviously, it would be nice to win another, another title, but it'll be what it'll be. <laughs> but out of all of her accomplishments, she's most proud of how she overcame her injury and what she's proven to herself. Being confident in knowing what I can do. Kruger and the rest of the indoor track and field team will be back in action March 3rd for the NAIA Indoor National Championships. In Helena, Kennedy Broadwell, MTN Sports.